Uh, my name is Vince McIntyre. Uh, I'm um, 67 years old. I was born in the west of Ireland. My, I'm a farmer and um, uh, I do woodworking. Um, I'm a jack of all trades. I've lived here uh, since 1979. I, uh, I found this place by accident. Decided to camp here with my girlfriend in 1979. She was a mountaineer, and we uh, made our temporary camp here. And here, 30 years later, we're still here. Uh, I, you know, my when I think of home, I think of the little thatch house I was born in in the west of Ireland. That's, uh, I still think of it as that. But uh, um, you know, I felt like a drifter, a traveler. I, 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 I'd, um, uh, you know, traveled all a lot around BC and uh, just seeing what was happening. I'd go down to the coast sometimes. I'd go up to the Caribou, the Chilcot, and, and camp and then find uh, some work to do for somebody. I work for a hay rancher up there, a cattle rancher. And help. That's where I first uh, used horses in, uh, in D.C. was uh, helping an old rancher put up hundreds of acres of hay with horses and uh, all the only machine. So I brought my girlfriend up here and I was just wanting to see how she felt about the place and she was just totally amazed by the place so from there I knew it was uh, from, from there I knew uh, you know both of us liked it so and uh, this was in October of 1979 so we wanted to make a camp and um, uh, back then I could really work hard eh? and we we wanted to make it so it wasn't really visible or whatever because it was on crown land. So we, I started digging down here and she helped me and we made that little downstairs place. Back then, I never thought I'd ever settle down, that I'd always be a traveler. But when I come up here and I watch the sun rise and, and set, that instilled something in me. Someday, I uh, maybe decide that, hey, I've had enough. At this age in my life, I'm not so concerned about the outcome. You know? I go out there and I do what I can, and. If it doesn't work, I've tried. Well, I think in today's world it's not necessary because when we, deliver, when we depend on an industrial system for our survival, we might protest all that and think that we're defeated and so on, but it still works, eh? But if we want to get our power back and uh, be able to do things for ourselves and not pay other people to live our lives for us, we have to be devoted. 